But there's somebody who's been with, uh, with us since year one of Broadway Con. And she is the queen of Con. <laughs> and we couldn't start this show off with anybody else. I know, are you tingling? Because I'm about to say it. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the glorious, the luscious, the scintillating, the glamorous Miss Leslie Margarita! I wanted to be in it. Hi. 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 Leslie's here. I'm going to leave. Are you? No. Okay. Let's, yes. Okay, we're not talking. We've rehearsed this so much. Year five, let's go! Gather around, I got a story to tell About a Manhattan lady that I know very well She lives at Five Riverside, her name is Shirley DeVore And she traveled around the world to meet the guy next door Well, there was trouble inside apartment 29E Where Shirley's mother and dad were as upset as can be They said, we hate to complain, dear, and we don't want to grouse But you nearly you should get out of the house. You gotta ring them bells. You gotta ring them bells. You gotta make them sing and really ring them bells. It's such a happy thing to hear them tingling. You gotta ring them bells. Well, Shirley was 31, which she was loath to admit. And she had never been loved, which didn't thrill her a bit. And so she sat and she thought, she thought for hours on end, and said, I'll go to Chase Manhattan, where I got me a friend. And so she borrowed a thou and called TWA and told her mother and dad that she was off and away. I'm going to travel the continent a month, maybe two, and haul me home a hus if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> I'm gonna ring them bells. I'm gonna ring them bells. I'm gonna make them sing and really ring them bells. It's such a happy thing to hear them sing a ling. I'm gonna ring them bells. She met a Londoner first, but they did not hit it off. Every time she approached, he got a bronchial cough. And so she went to Madrid and met a handsome senor. But he liked to throw the ball, and he was no matador. She also bombed out in Brussels, in Mallorca and Rome. Till someone said, well, try to prove the day before you go home. Because it's the kind of a town where you're likely to fall. And all the Tony Cognizanti find the ball in the bowl. Darling, you must go to Dubrovnik. You must go. I'm telling you, you must go. Okay. <laughs> You've got to ring them bells. You've got to ring them bells. You've got to make them sing and really ring them bells. It's such a happy thing to hear them jingling. You've got to ring them bells. <laughs> so she went to Dubrovnik and the very first day, and a guy on the beach who took her reason away. Yes, it was love at first sight and such a beautiful scene. She said, my name is Cheryl DeVore. He said, I'm Norm Sapistein. She said, are you from New York? He said, that can't be denied. I got a swell junior three at number five, Riverside. Wait, wait, you, you live at five, five Riverside Drive in 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 New York City, five to Riverside Drive, because that's where that's you can't live. Are you sure? And if that wasn't enough, poor Shirley thought she'd gone deaf when he told her his apartment there was 29 F. Yeah. She was E, he was F, and they had not even met till Shirley traveled the world to Yugoslavia yet. He'd always been right next door, and she would never have known if she hadn't tried to Brubnik, she might still be alone. So there's a moral 
lot to learn from little Shirley DeVore, who had to travel the world to meet the fella next door. You girls who live in apartments, don't just stare at the wall. Open up that door and hurry out in the hole. Everybody lies with me. And rah, 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 rah. Ring them bells, God, ring them. Now here's what you need to know. Yes. From from the seats that you're in, this fourth wall does not exist this <laughs> weekend, and none of us would be up here if we weren't the very people. We'd be buying tickets if we weren't up here. Um, when did you first fall in love with Broadway? What was the thing that like took you over the edge? Uh, literally like three years old, watching Judy Garland. Oh yeah. Yeah, watching Judy Garland movie, and just I totally fell in love with her and that voice, and then I got into Broadway, and then I became like a massive fan of everything, and yeah. and wore like a phantom mask around the house, and same. Me too. Yeah, great, same. Yeah. <laughs> Leslie Marguerite, everybody. You'll see me later. <laughs> Woo! The Queen of Con. I do have one problem with the lyrics in Ring Them Bells that Shirley DeVore is so upset to be single at 31 years old. I'm 41 year old, one years old. Where's my Norm Saperstein? <laughs> I'm gonna write a book called Searching for Norm Saperstein. <laughs>